Skills are essential to the development of every country. It is important that we not only recognize the benefits of skills, but that we encourage vocational training and education to the highest level. Competitions like World Skills Barbados and World Skills International allow students and professionals to test their skills against others within the island and then internationally. Executive Director of the TVET Council and Barbados's official delegate to World Skills Abu Dhabi, Henderson Eastman, shares why he thinks World Skills International is important. It is important for us to expose our people to world-class events like the World Skills, where you have so many countries participating. And when you go there, you will see the level at which people are at. And if you compete at that level, both the competitors and the experts who are working here in the institution will see, and you will be able to bring back something to your institution. And not only bring back, but be promoters yourself to let people know that we still have a long way to go to raise the standard of technical and vocational education, especially in the areas of technology. He believes it's time people are able to attain a degree in the higher level skill areas needed by the country. The council is aggressively trying to push the institutions to move especially the tertiary level institutions like the Polytechnic and the Barbados Vocational Training Board as well as community college to raise the level of standard of their training, higher level technical qualifications, at least to the degree level. We think that after 50 years of independence, we should be there. We have to move there if we are to be competitive as a nation. We have to make our country more competitive. It means that we have to fire on more than one sector, not only tourism. We want to help put our people into position that we can reduce that $800 million food bill. We want to resuscitate manufacturing in such a way we may not be able to export right away. Every dollar we earn, we save in foreign exchange now because of the situation, it's like a dollar earned. So if there are small things that we import that we can make here, we would like to equip our people to make them. Training and retraining is just as important in vocational areas as it is in academics. We are going to work relentlessly over the next couple of years to ensure that we have training in this country at least the degree level in some of the important sectors. We want to help expand the creative industry. We want to help in the renewable energy sector. If there's a penny oil industry out of the south coast where they're selling oil blocks, we want our people trained to work in there. So there is a lot to learn in going to these world-class um, is another investment in your people. The TVET Council has adopted a more business-oriented <coughs> approach, aggressively going after the business. And we have been doing some work in training and helping our regional partners. And our mission has been changed to a world-class workforce organization for the region. But we are also progressive, trying to go after international business so that we can help supplement the funds and the dependency from the government and we can have funds to help for projects such as these. World Skills continues to recognize the importance of excellence in skills development and will continue to encourage and promote vocational training to the highest level.